Hey guys, time for a little ladder content featuring yours truly. I am playing on the ladder with the extremely appropriate and classy alt in dog years. She's 21. <coughs> Whew. Anyhow, uh, playing against Starmaster here. You guys probably have heard of him. He's been in all my, not all of my, but my past two Callus Invitationals. He's also an SPL player. He's really good, even though he's a ghosting cheater. So... Here is the game that we had on the ladder. This was bruh, about a week or so ago, so I kind of sort of forget the details, but bear with me. Alrighty. It is myself on the bottom on that really cool alt with Zapdos against Starmaster, who, guess what, also has a Zapdos. Stay in for the T-Wave, and he has a Celebi here. I will switch to Skarm, and he's going to Leech Seed. Seems fine. Uh, spiking here, I mean, is the obvious play, right? It's one of those things where if he has Magneton, sucks to suck, right? But it's ladder, YOLO, so there are some spikes. And he doesn't seem to have a Magneton, but he does have a Rapid Spinner in Starmie. So here comes Lax, and here is Hydro Pump doing 28 big ones. Possibly thinking maybe I go Gengar, I switch back to Zapdos there. I could see him wanting to get chip damage on some of the things I could have potentially switched in there. And Lax is just going to go Body Slam here. Going to encounter a T-Tower that I didn't know was there, but I mean, makes a lot of sense. And I do not find the Lucky Paralysis. He's going to go Focus Punch at this point. Metagross will take it neutrally. Uh, except for it's a critical hit, and it's going to do 99% and put me at 1. That's what I planned for, though. Don't you worry. This play I don't love from Star Master. Uh, he's going to walk his Starmie right into the boom. Uh, I don't know if he just didn't anticipate that. It felt like he was playing around a Meteor Mash. Or if he really thought that the least valuable thing on his team was the Starmie. And that's what he wanted to sacrifice. But I was pretty happy with that trade. Because I got an even one for one trade after getting crit with the Focus Punch. So I kind of made up for a lot of lost ground there. I was really happy with this sequence too, so I got the baton pass off, he stayed in, went rock slide, this is basically going to be a free pick off on the T-Tar via the Dugtrio pass, so down that guy goes, and I'm going to take the lead here. Now Zapdos comes in, which, I mean, my best bet is Lax, but I got to be a little bit careful, he can't stick around forever, it's still the right play for now, but I mean, he's no blissy when it comes to long term special walling. And I'm going to get hit with a para on the way in with that 10% Thunderbolt after effect, which is lame sauce. So here comes a Dougie of his own. I'm not sure. I think maybe he thought I was going to go for rest, which is why I think he did that. But I just went for self-destruct. So once again, I negate the hacks by simply blowing up on something. Yeah, you parried me, but it doesn't matter because I got a one-for-one -one trade in the end. So, I've now got a 4-3. We both have hidden last pokes. I know mine, obviously, but I don't know what his is, even though, I mean, it's it's got to just be like Swampert or Flygon, right, based on the rest of the team. That's what makes sense to me. Uh, so, it's Thunder Wave and Thunder Bolt, respectively. Now, I Thunderbolt him after I wave him, and I do a lot. I do more than his does, but because he bolted on the turn before, I'm going to go down and I've got Gengar here coming in for cleanup duty. And if it is a Flygon or a Swamp Bird in the back, I'm in great shape. Because I've got both Ice Punch and HP Grass. And I plan to do some work. I do not get the Crit of the Freeze. The Celebi is really my only obstacle at this point. Because the Gengar beats the crap out of the other two pokes. So I just have to find the right sequence where I can catch the Celebi with the Dugtrio. Or at least hit it with the Dugtrio low enough to where the Gengar can clean up. Either or. But the key thing is eventually Dugtrio has to hit Celebi. That's really the only thing that matters here. So I'm going to spike up. Him killing me would be fantastic because it's just going to enable Dugtrio to do his thing. I mean, unless I'm just blatantly flat out wrong about what his last poke is. But I mean, I've played this line that it kind of has to be one of those logical things that I'm thinking that it is. And if it is some random obscure thing that I'm totally off about, if it's last poke lax or something... I'm probably in trouble, but it just kind of is what it is. So there is the taunt. All right, here's me playing to my line. This is really the only play that I have. Celebi can't switch because of Arena Trap. Obviously, his attack is going to kill me, so I'm going to get him with my biggest, baddest HP bug on the way out. No crit, that's fine. It is all going to come down to Gengar. He can kill Zapdos. He can kill Celebi. It just comes down to what's the last poke. Like I said, if it is Swampert or if it is Flygon, I gotcha. If it's not one of those, I probably don't gotcha. 
But here is the Ice Punch. Down goes Celebi. That is step one. He shows me that it's Swampert. That's pretty good. I just have to run the Kelk to make sure I can actually kill him with HP Grass if he's bulky. Because what I don't want to do is have him survive, knock him into Torrent range, and then have him kill me with Hydro Pump. That is bad news, Bears. I do the Kelk. And he's going to protect here and get more HP. I do the Calc again. This is a super, super, super offensive Gengar. And as such, the Hidden Power is going to get him, even though he's at 88%. And that leaves him with only the Paralyzed Zapdos. So I'm going to punch on the chin with some ice, knock him out, and send fucking Ghostmaster back to Little Cup where he belongs. And by that, I mean he's an SPL starter while I am rotting on the bench. But... Moral victory for winning on ladder. Alrighty, I got this one. I got more ladder content for you. Thumbs up if you liked it. I will see you guys there.